always tracking, always alerting. Storm Team 8. And good morning, West Michigan. We're starting off on a pretty quiet note for us once again. After what was a gorgeous day yesterday filled with sunshine, we talked about the potential of seeing some scattered showers or thunderstorms overnight, but pretty much all of that has missed us off to the north. You'll notice that passing through northern Michigan here in West Michigan, just a little bit of cloud cover in the vicinity. Not a whole lot and should clear out of here pretty quickly to bring back mostly sunny skies once again. But we'll be watching that sunrise closely again just after 7 a.m. this morning. Should be another pretty Pretty good one compared to yesterday. Temperatures not bad this morning either. It's actually quite warm if you're stepping out the door. Uh, we're sitting in the upper 50s to about mid 60s. It's quite the spread. 66 right now in South Haven, 59 here in Grand Rapids, and 58 in Allendale. Highs today will reach those low to mid 70s. It very well could be the warmest day that we've had so far this year. We did have one day in those low 70s towards the end of February. You may remember we had a severe weather threat that day as well. So uh, very similar conditions to that, but we'll see if we manage to uh, get the warmest day of the year so far. As far as that future cast, that cloud cover, as mentioned, gets out of here pretty quickly. We'll have clear skies today and clear skies tonight. Wind should die down a bit overnight once again. As we head into our Monday, a little bit more cloud cover expected as we head throughout the evening and overnight, but still should be a mostly sunny and really pleasant day out there. Those temperatures will certainly still be on the warmer side of things. Things get a little bit interesting, though, as we head towards the middle of the week. We're still tracking a chance for some showers and thunderstorms, primarily Tuesday and Wednesday. Tuesday should start off dry, simply just cloudy out there, highs in the mid-60s. We'll start to see the chance for some showers and potentially a non-severe thunderstorm Tuesday night into Wednesday. But Wednesday is the day I think we're watching closely now. That'll be our best chance to see some thunderstorms in the vicinity. But we're missing out on the severe threat on Tuesday and even on Wednesday at this point. So here's that Tuesday severe weather threat. If you tuned in yesterday morning, I discussed we may make it into that marginal risk, which is that level one out of five. They're keeping that actually off to our southwest for the time being. And you'll notice that bullseye pretty far off to our west in Iowa as well as in Missouri. Now, showing you the future cast, what will happen here is a warm front lifts across the region. That'll give us those chance for those scattered showers late Tuesday. But really the heaviest and most widespread showers will hold off until early Wednesday morning. As low pressure continues to circulate through, there is a chance again that we get a strong to severe thunderstorm. But we should be back to dry conditions by late Thursday morning with just a few showers lingering early into Thursday morning. So now we're looking at that Wednesday severe threat. You'll notice that 15% chance pretty far off to our south. So we may manage to dodge this one as well, the way this system has set up. But we'll watch as we get a little bit closer to things. What we do know is it will be cooler behind this system. We'll see those high temperatures once again dip down to those upper 50s by Thursday and then 50 degrees for high on Friday. Next weekend also looking on the cooler side, especially compared to where we are today. Today, we'll see those highs in those upper 40s on Saturday and low 50s on Sunday. So soak in the sunshine, take advantage of the warm air as it continues to hold in our area for the time being. Again, we'll keep an eye on that thunderstorm potential, but as of now, it looks like we'll miss out on the worst of things there. Well, that's good. I mean, but I'll take the 70s for now, just right. for one day. One day. Three. that is so nice. I think all <laughs> the restaurants maybe will put out their uh, tables yep. today and take advantage of that. So, yeah. yeah, but at least get the dust off of them. Mm -hmm. because, for so. sure. All right. Thanks, Sarah.